is music from the heart from FBC Dwight, the First Baptist Church of Dwight. Appreciate you tuning in. And we have multiple dozens of people already watching, I believe. So if you would, take a moment, like the broadcast. You can hear some great music here shortly. Uh, we have a, a ladies group starting off in just a moment here. I'd like to start off with an introduction to the concept. I'm going to go to Proverbs chapter number 4 and verse number 23. The title is Music from the Heart. Proverbs 4.23 says, Keep thy heart with all diligence, for out of it are the issues of life. Verse number 24, Put away from thee a forward mouth, and perverse lips put far from thee. And so don't be tempted in the least to go over to watch the mainstream media right now. Don't go through your Facebook feed because I think all you'll find there is a bunch of people with forward mouths and perverse lips, especially on the media. Um, I heard someone earlier, I won't tell you who, said something about wanting to pu punch one of our elected officials in the face. Um, it, it, she, she says it wasn't her. Um, so anyway, stay here for the next hour or so. You'll enjoy the music. I'm going to have Brother Tim come and lead us in a word of prayer to open up the, the service tonight. While he comes to pray, if the ladies group going to sing good old gospel singing, if they could make their way to the platform as well, and then we'll have a recorded special right after them. So ladies, you make your way here. Brother Tim, you pray for us as we begin. Heavenly Father, we thank you for this day and the many blessings that you give us each and every day. Heavenly Father, we thank you for the opportunity you have given us to be part of this tonight. I ask that you might bless this evening, bless the music. May it be a blessing to the people, put a song in their heart. Heavenly Father, thank you so much for a church that cares and for a pastor that cares so much for his people that he provides these opportunities. I ask that you might watch over each and every one of us, help us to sit back, enjoy the evening, and to remember you're in control. In Jesus' name, amen. I recall a slender steeple, a church house filled with people, and voices lifted up in happy song. With music so inviting, so warm and so exciting, I had to enter in and sing along. And as I joined right with them, what harmony and rhythm, my heart was lifted up to heaven above. I felt like shouting glory when I heard the gospel story, the songs about my Jesus and his love. I love that good old gospel singing, happy gospel singing, ringing out so loud and clear. Like an angel choir, how it lifts me higher, making heaven seem so near. Come on and join right in the chorus, really swell the chorus, let that happy song singing, happy gospel singing, ringing out so loud and clear. Like an angel choir, how it lifts me higher, making heaven seem so near. Come on and join right in the chorus, really swell the chorus, let that happy song prolong. Everybody
prove that God's not really real. But others say they know for sure his love you cannot feel. But I know he's real within my soul. For one day he cleansed and made me whole. And Jesus is still the answer for the longing deep in your soul. Jesus is still the answer. No time and age is roll. Jesus is still He's the answer for your soul. And though some may say he doesn't fit with their philosophy, I know Jesus is still the answer. He's always been and always will be. Some men pretend that the things of this world have brought them peace of mind. But with the dawn of each new day, new thrills they try to find. But not until they meet the Prince of Peace can they ever hope to find relief for Jesus is still the answer for a world that's seeking for peace Jesus is still the answer and time and ages roll Jesus is still the answer, he's the answer for the soul. Though some may say he doesn't fit with their philosophy, I know Jesus is still the answer, yes, Jesus is still I know Jesus is still the answer. He's always been and always will be. Thank you so much, ma'am. That was excellent. Praise the Lord. Now, in just a moment, we have a mixed trio that's going to come and sing. They can begin to make their way this direction, but we'd like to ask for some audience participation from you as well. Uh, after the mixed trio comes and sings two songs, we'd like you to comment your favorite congregational song that we might be able to find in the hymnal. And we're going to put the pressure on our song leader and on our piano players, I think, and we're going to sing some of your favorite congregational songs. And so if you would, right now, uh, like the broadcast, of course, share the broadcast, but then go ahead and comment your favorite congregational song, and then we'll throw a curveball at them and have them sing uh, that in just a moment here. So we're going to have the mixed trio come and sing for us. You'll enjoy that. They'll sing two songs, and then we'll come back with a congregational song in just a moment. You folks come and sing. Oh, 
Amen, amen. Brother Ed, don't go too crazy far, because I think you might be leading a song here in just a moment. I think I texted you a couple of the, the ones that came through. So I, well, dealer's choice. You get to choose who, who, uh, what song we're singing. I think we had four or five songs requests came in. Keep them coming, because we do have another congregational song that we'll sing in just a moment here. I want to thank all the folks that put so much work into the practice uh, for this uh, Music from the Heart Night. And then also the piano players and Brother Ed for organizing it and making it happen and uh, practicing, of course, with all the groups. And so, Brother Ed, if you have a song... Put you right on the spot right here. And go ahead and please continue to comment if you have another song. We'll do another in just a moment here. After this song, Miss Laura Colvin is going to come and sing. And then Miss Lori Carmen. I'm, I'm sorry, she's going to play the piano. You, you, you're not going to sing as well this time? Okay, she, Laura is going to play the piano, I guess. And, um, and then Miss Lori Carmen is going to sing for us immediately after that. And so we'll have this congregational song. Brother Ed introduced it to us. And maybe since the few folks that are here, maybe we can sing along with you and support you. All right, we're going to do two, num number 216, Dwelling in Beulah Land. You can remain seated unless you're at home, then you have to stand up and sing along with us. But uh, number 216, we'll sing the first and the fourth verse. Let's hear you over the airwaves. Here we go. Far away the noise of strife upon my ear is calling.
Thank you so much. We'll have a, a mixed quartet in just a moment. I'll be joined by my wife and brother and sister-in-law in just a moment. We'll sing. But for just a second, Brother Ed, if you'd grab that microphone there. I just want to talk for just a second for folks that are at home getting depressed and despondent and just, just so over all of this corona stuff and all that. Some thoughts about the importance of music and maybe from personal testimony for you, maybe a favorite song that you enjoy or just during this time, uh, maybe how music has been a little bit of a help to you. We can speak on that for just a moment. All right. Uh, well, we listen to music. Well, I listen to music a lot. Our, we always have the radio on at our house. It's uh, going 24 hours a day. Um, just really enjoy good music. And there are some times that, uh, especially when you have what's going on around you now, uh, there's just sometimes there's just a song God brings across your path or, right. or you just happen to accidentally listen to it. And it really just speaks to your heart. Um, uh, one of the songs that, uh, right when the, the beginning of all this started coming out and everybody was, people were scared, people didn't know what was going on, didn't have a clue what was going on, but they were just a lot of, a lot of fear, a lot of people just scared. Um, one of the songs that uh, really meant a lot to me is uh, Ron Hamilton's song, My Hope is Jesus. And... I've probably played that song over 50 times just because it's so, so good. And, you know, if you can just keep your eye on the solution and not the problem mm -hmm. and having good music, having good songs, 
uh, having appropriate songs for the time that really helps you to keep your focus where it needs to be. Right, absolutely. And a thought, you know, keeping, and practically speaking, and try to give practical thoughts, have music playing around your home. You know, I think a lot of times we wonder, you know, if the spirit of the home is a little, you know, wonky and things like that. People at home a little more uh, together than they would normally be. Play some music. You know, they've got a great radio station, yes. WGBD. So many great options, so, so much good music out there, and we don't use it oftentimes. Right, and we've got the radio, and every one of us have you know, phones, and of course, it's just pretty much uh, Lydia and me and Emma now, but uh, um, but everybody's got music on their phone, and I hear, uh, it, 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 it's not uncommon to have three or four different devices playing something different, mm -hmm. and, you know, I just think that, I think God has blessed our home, our family, because of, in this one aspect, because right. we got the music <clears throat> part of it right, right. Even, there's nothing better than and I get up in the morning, quarter to four, and come downstairs, and the radio is playing softly right, right there. That's right. I mean, some of the options might not be so great at four in the morning, but uh, <laughs> uh, but anyway, the point is, music's there. It's available in the morning. It's available at night. It's available all the time. You have good options, good things right. to pick from, and it will just it'll move you. It'll lift you up, or it'll bring you down. Amen. So. You have to have good music. Amen. Well, we'll have another congregational song. Thank you, Brother Ed. The Mixed Quartet's going to come. We're going to sing here in just a moment. Practically speaking, though, don't make Sunday morning the next time you hear a good gospel song in your home. And don't just wait Thursday night, Friday, Saturday, and then till Sunday. Play some good music in your home. Now, we'll have a Mixed Quartet, and then immediately after that, Miss Lori Carmen and Miss Lydia Seibert are going to sing, I believe, up for us in just a moment here. So right after this, they will sing. Jesus, keep me near the cross. There a precious fountain, free to all a healing stream flows from Calvary's mouth.
songs tonight. Uh, we're going to sing another congregational song, so if you have a songbook there, uh, we're going to turn to page number 91, and we're going to sing What a Day That Will Be. We'll sing uh, both verses of page 91. This side, of the, uh, this side of the auditorium did really great the last time. This side's got to pick it up. Come on, let's hear you. I see that hand in the back. Thank you. All right, page number 91. Number 91. What a day that will be. Thank you. Here we go. There is coming a day when no heartaches, clouds in the sky, no more tears to dim the eye. All is peace forevermore on that happy golden shore. What a day, glorious day that will be. What a day. And I look upon his face, the one who saved me by his grace. When he takes me by the hand and leads me through the promised land, what a day, glorious day that will be. Excellent job this side of the auditorium. There will be no sorrow there, no more burdens to bear. No more sickness, no pain, no more parting over there. And forever I will be with the one who died for me. What a day, glorious day, that will be. What a day that will be when my Jesus I shall 
put a lot of elbow grease into tonight and just contacting groups and, and uh, putting some stuff together on the fly. And so appreciate that very much, sir, and all those that practiced and made it possible. And so we have a men's group that's going to sing for us now. Heaven came down and glory filled my soul. Oh, what a wonderful, wonderful day, day I will never forget. After I wandered in darkness away, Jesus my Savior I met. Oh, what a tender, compassionate friend, he met the need of my heart. Shadows dispelling with joy and telling he made all the darkness depart. Heaven came down and glory filled my soul. When at the cross the Savior made me whole. My sins were washed away and my night was turned to day. Heaven came down and glory filled my soul. Now I have a hope that will surely endure after the passing of time. I have a future in heaven for sure, there in those mansions sublime. And it's because of that wonderful day when at the cross I believe. Rich, eternal, and blessings eternal from His precious hand I receive. Heaven came down and glory filled my soul. When at the cross the Savior made me whole. My sins were washed away and my night was turned to day. Heaven came down and glory filled my soul. Heaven came down and glory filled my soul. Battles I would face 
Great song to almost end the night with. Brother Ed's going to come and lead us in one more congregational. So belt it out from your lazy boy, from your couch there. And please, thank, I want to say thank you so much to each of the folks that made an effort uh, to, to practice and to sing for us and play for us tonight. Uh, it's no easy feat, especially with uh, all kinds of crazy stuff going on and personal lives with just work and all that type of stuff. And so thank you so much. And thank you for tuning in as well. And FBC Dwight folks, don't take for granted the uh, amazing music and the talents that God has given uh, the folks here at F First Baptist Church of Dwight. And Brother Ed, come, and if you lead a song and then close us in a word of prayer. I'll do it, yes, sir. All right, all right, we're going to sing 435, Since Jesus Came Into My Heart. We'll sing the first and the last. 435, here we go on the first. What a wonderful change in my life has been brought Since Jesus came into my heart. I have lied in my soul for which long I had sought since Jesus came into my heart. Since Jesus came into my heart. Since Jesus came into my heart. Floods of joy o'er my soul like the sea billows roll. Watch me. glasses on. It's a wasted effort. Here we go. Last verse. I shall go there to dwell in that city I know since Jesus came into my heart. And I'm happy, so happy as onward I go since Jesus came into my heart. Since Jesus came This is what I miss the most right here. This bunch of crazy. Too bad you didn't see all of this, but uh, it's, it's, that's what I miss yeah. the most. And on that note, let's pray. Father, thank you for tonight. Lord, thank you for the opportunity to gather again, even if it's just a small part of us. I pray God that you'd bless. I pray God that you continue to watch over us. I pray God that you'd help us to uh, be a blessing to those around us, Lord, to live, live like a light in the world of darkness. God, thank you for the music. Thank you for the singing. Thank you for the hearts behind it. I pray, God, you bring us back together soon, and we ask these things in Jesus' name. Amen.